One year out, where do you think the market will be? Will it be up, up, or up? It's gonna. I believe it's gonna be up, up, up. Well, I I think a year from now, if we haven't hit 100k Bitcoin a year from now, like the market's probably only going to give us 105 to 115 thousand dollar Bitcoin, maybe 95 if it really hates us. But like that would be like I think a 10 percent chance at the moment. Very unlikely. Yeah. Outside of like nuclear war or something really bad or, you know. Yeah. Like, yeah. Any macro event that just like takes us down, you know, for an extended period of time, even if it's just a few months. Um, yeah. Never good. Yeah. In terms of like anything short term that possibly could really shake the market up. Uh, anything more than like a 50 basis point cut in one shot from the Fed. We are going to get rate cuts on the 18th. But, you know, it's kind of like, is it 25? Is it 50? Is it 75? And uh, 75 isn't off the table. It's not very likely. It's more like 15 to 25 is really the, the real mm-hmm. big two. And most people are hoping it's probably 25s. But, um, you know, if they, it, it, it's it's kind of like they always start off with a bang and then just kind of go moderate. So I, I'm probably more inclined to say 50 over 25. But any cut, any cut's really good, just regardless, yeah. because it just starts lowering the interest rates, which is good overall for the economy. But, uh, Housing is not doing that hot, and it's going to continue to go down. But, you know, if interest rates go down fast enough, uh, you might start getting um, – it, it it's this weird thing where, like, we haven't had a lot of people put their properties up for sale just because the interest rates are so high, people can't really afford them. So yeah. you could get – if the interest rates get low enough, you could get a flood of boomers posting properties to sell, and that actually could even drop the prices even lower, <laughs> possibly. And it'll only be a hundred fifty thousand dollar rebate if you live in California. Oh wait, no, you have to be moving to California, right? Moving, no. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, well, at least you know with the rate cuts and everything, you know, it signifies that they'll will be doing more money printing as well. So you know, short term wise, it's good for everybody. So like the next one year, you know, liquidity cycle is up. We have more money coming into the system, like. I think, you know, and then Bitcoin is more scarce than it has been, you know, pretty much ever. So right. I think that's the recipe, right? <laughs> so, uh, 